Ladies and gentlemen, in association with Murray River Council, welcome to the final of the ladies' competition here at the 2023 Australian Darts Open. It takes place at Moama Bowling Club and it's brought to you by Darts Australia. We introduce from England, ranked number five in the world, a former Australian Darts Open champion and the reigning Pacific Masters champion. Four times the Lakeside champion of the world, the Lancashire Rose, Lisa Ashton. We now bring to the stage the player ranked number two in the world, a former World Trophy and World Masters champion. She's the reigning Dutch Open champion from the Netherlands, Eileen de Graaf. It's final time here at the 2023 Australian Darts Open. Eileen de Graaf and Lisa Ashton, the two ladies contesting this ladies' final over the best of 15 legs. Kelvin James joins me once again. I think we're all still in a state of shock after the oh, last game. What a whirlwind that was. Andy Barton's 8-0 victor over defending champion Raymond Smith. Raymond Smith did first not throw is Lisa to badly. First. Just got Raymond. smashed by the hurricane that is Andy Barton's. You know, just looking at the averages, Raymond averaged 93 and barely got a sniff. Whoa, oh, whoa, look at this, talking of sniffs. Morning. <laughs> what a way to start the final. 85. What a response. The 125 in response. To, oh, it's 85, sorry, I thought that was a 125. Very close. 16. I should have gone to spec savers. <laughs> <laughs> Both of these ladies. 14. Emphatic winners in their semi-finals. Lisa Ashton, 6. Love against Desi Mercer. And Lisa's filling it up again, Look, Stop that, you. Wow. <laughs> what a magnificent leg of darts. Oh, 81. Eileen. 81 after 9. 81. Treble 10 would leave double 16. That leaves six, uh, 17. Yes. <laughs> Is that another player arguing 16. with the referee, <laughs> not believing what he's saying? I don't think she believed where her dad landed, mm. Anthony. But she will be back for a ping at 2 8. Lisa, you require Eileen 16. has left herself a finish after 12. But it's 2 8 for the Lancashire Rose. Yeah, that's Kim Short in the first Make sure, second time of asking. 
Second leg, it's our lead. The third Quite first. Fire. One Heaven. nil lead. One over then, 37. I have to say, both these ladies, even though they probably haven't shown their best form until the latter stages of the tournament, there really is a big gap in the scoring power and, more importantly, the finishing power of these two. Yep, Eileen de Graaf began her Australian darts open campaign with a 4-0 win over Melina van den Kieboom and a 4-2 win over Amanda Locke. 40. Before dispatching Joe Hadley 6-1 in the semis. Lisa, on the other hand, a 4-1 win over Nicole Reno. First 42. match, 4-0 win over Janine Kasser. And then she dismantled Desi Mercer 6-0 in the semi-final. Yes. Sensational scoring by both ladies. Just a one blip of a 42 in between for nope, Eileen de Graff. 40. Eileen, you require 88. 88 then for Eileen. 18 leaves the bull. Treble 18 leaves. Double seven. 81. Lisa, you require 96. Don't blink, folks. Yep, this is going to be quick fire. 48. Go. I mean, 8 you 7 still be over seven. in a matter of moments as Esme looks on. 2 Yes. <laughs> Great minds think alike. Full seldom differ. <laughs> <laughs> a chance gifted then to Lisa. Make sure of the 16. Double 16. Two eights. Uh, that's King Short in his second round. Lisa oh. Ashton. 2-0 to the Lancashire Third Rose. Lisa, Lisa Ashton, four times former world champion. 134. Tremendous scoring power. 44. One of them Amazing. One three four, one three seven. Ninety-six. One hundred. Yes, another match this time for the Dutch. Eileen de Graaf. 130 then for Lisa. She's got six at it if she needs them. Will she go the bull? That's 80. Doesn't have to go the bull. Which she does anyway. anyway. <laughs> <laughs> 25 left when she returns. Eileen back on 181. That's for a quick fire 3 0 lead. Lisa, you require 25. Best of 15 legs this final. Yeah, that's been oh, in the first superb. Round. 14 Please dark legs. This is a pleasure. Ashton. A pleasure to watch. The Takes the average to around about the 98 mark. Wow. 100. Eileen not playing at all badly. Average 86 and just... Yes, not getting a sniff. 98.02 for Lisa. And 86.29 for 95. Eileen. There's Mechie. Still smiling. Despite his quarter final exit. 100. Did have a word with Mechie after his match with Raymond Smith. He shook my hand and said, At least I turned up today, pup. I said, Well, yes. He's the biggest critic, I am sure. Uh, as are most of the leading players. There's Aaron Morrison with Carl Schaefer, both participants in this year's tournament. 55. One of them, 40. Wendell's <laughs> still enjoying herself. One of them, 40. Great I pass. These ladies have slacked off a little bit, only the 
Five tons between them so far in this leg. No, that's shocking, if you ask me. 56. Lisa, you require 106. <laughs> <laughs> Treble 18. Would have left double 16. 68 left. 58. Eileen, you require a chance for Eileen de Graaf to open her account in this final. 32. Ah, it's there. The Pulls back a leg to 3-1. Lisa Ashton leads Eileen de Graaf in this ladies' final of the Australian Darts Open. Oh. Oh, that's, what you, that's what you get for hitting the double against me. I'll just smack in a 180. <laughs> Beautiful darts by Eileen. Superb. Responding with a 140. I'll say it once and I'll say it again. To all you female Australian dart players, this is what you have to practice towards. This is the kind of level that's out there today at the top of the top of the tree. Absolutely. These two are two of the most decorated ladies in the sport. Oh, and another 182 in the leg from Lisa Ashton. Goodness, goodness me. Scintillating. One of the end, 23. Lisa, you require 41. 41 after just nine darts. 32. Double eight for a 12 dart leg. 33. Oh, wires width away. Forty-two, Lisa, you require eight. Double four for a four-one lead. Lisa Ashton, oh, just like that, no time at Lisa all. Ashton. Well, says he may well clap. Lisa Ashton putting on a show, ninety-nine point six one against Eileen, who's on an eighty-six twenty-eight. Amazing darts by both these ladies. This is top of the top top shelf stuff, it really without is. a doubt. 83. 58. As I say, Eileen de Graaf, world number two, by a fair distance 81. to Bo Greaves at number one. Snack him. <laughs> <laughs> Amongst 100. the best the ladies' game has to offer, these two alongside the likes of Bo Greaves, Rihanna O'Sullivan, the great Dita Hedman, 97. Lorraine Wynne Stanley, Anastasia Dobromislova, legends of the ladies' game, Trina Gulliver, of course, 58. helped put the ladies' game on the map. Yes, yeah, she won multiple world titles, did Trina? Yeah, just the 10. <laughs> it's good to see her getting back to good health. 100. Even though we're in a period of Bo Greaves domination, the strength and depth of the ladies' game is just getting better and better all the time. Yes, that's right. So much so that the uh, Professional Dance Corporation have created... 100. They're on women's section. Yep, the women's series. women's series. Another thing that's going from strength to strength. Eileen going the bull route on 92. 10 leaves double 16. 76. That would have been for 4 Lisa 2 instead. Ashton has darts in hand. That tops for 5 1. To move 3 away from the title. Uh, and Lisa Incredible Ashton. stuff from Lisa Ashton. Not forgetting Eileen de Graaf playing her part in this. Sensational ladies final. Yep, Lisa was precariously close to the ton average. And <laughs> if she keeps doing that, she might just get it. I'm beginning to feel sorry for the triple 20 with these two ladies. Yeah. 80. These ladies have a lot of experience playing against each other. No less than 10 times over the past 18 months. They have done battle with one another. 60. Lisa has come out on top. The majority of those games, however, Eileen de Graaf does have a couple of victories over 55. Lisa. Once in the semi-final of the Women's World Match Play last year. Eileen came out winner 5-4 there. And 100. at the Women's Series in Hildesheim last August, Eileen did a job on Lisa, beating her 4-0, averaging nearly 94 in the process. 15. 
No strangers, these two. Played no less than 27 times. 100. Over the past nine years or so. And that's just the recorded ones. I'm sure there's other open tournaments all over the place that maybe weren't recorded on Dart Connect or Darts for Windows or whatever other program you would use. Tops for a 118. 78. Oh. I mean, you require 152. That would have been for a 15 dart leg. 152. Ah, goes the 19s route. I like that. Two treble 19s would have left the double. 49. Lisa, you require. So 40. for a 6 1 lead, Lisa Ashton wants 40. Double 10. Double 5. 30. I mean, you require 103. Thanks for the flights, Neil and Lisa. Oh. Lisa, you so another chance then for ten. Lisa. Two tens. Big one for double two. Oh, Oops, oh. Score. so used to I hitting the triple 20. <laughs> the dart went there of its own accord. Two fives then for Eileen de Graaf. Oh no. And oh. Lisa, you she's left a double, but ten. she will not be overly pleased that it's double one she's left. So double five for Lisa Ashton. Yeah, and she moves into a 6 1 lead Ashton. in this best of Eight 15 Ashton legs. Ladies final at the Australian Darts Open here at the Moama Bowling Club. What a treat these two ladies are giving us this Ashton. afternoon. The last time these two did battle was a matter of weeks ago at the Women's Series in Milton Keynes. Quarter final stage. Lisa Ashton came out the winner, defeating Eileen de Graaf by five legs to two in that particular match, averaging just under 93 in 71. the process. Currently averaging around about 93. Was flirting with the 100 a leg or two ago. But, as I've said a few times, you don't put the averages on the trophy. No. Lisa will just be happy to be in front and heading towards victory. Well, a 6 1 lead. Leaves Eileen with all the work to do if she's to be in with any chance of lifting this trophy. One hundred and thirty-eight. That's, that's excellent, Darts. One six seven when she returns. Fifty-eight. Lisa, you require one hundred and sixty-seven to go one away from the title. Not to be this time. Great last start though. 218 for Eileen, just looking to set it up. 79, Lisa, you require 84. Double oh. 12. Double 6 for a 15 dart leg. 78, Eileen, you require 139. And if she comes back, she has left herself the ash down. <laughs> oh, she might not come back. She might not come back, Tops. 119. Lisa, you require six. Very close. It's a magnificent finish. Double three, though, for Lisa. That's awkward. Yeah, she'll have to move, I think. And she does. Yep, she's almost in a chicka for throwing this one. No score. <laughs> Arlene, you require there we go. 20. <laughs> Darkness descends. Uh, that's and that's the second leg for Eileen de Graaf, taking out double ten. As she pulls back a leg to be two to six. The deficit, four legs in favour of Lisa Ashton. But is it delaying the inevitable? Great darts from de Graaf. There is no rhyme or reason to Eileen de Graaf playing 16. darts. One minute she'll go 19s, then she'll go 20s, then back to the 20s, then 19s again. <laughs> she just can't make her mind up. Well, whichever way she goes. She's very successful at it. Absolutely. <laughs> That's five treble 19s out of six in this leg. 96. Eighty-five. Ronald. Yep, Ronald Nakata played some good stuff today. 
84. Arlene, you require 112. Oh, 100. Oh, yeah. I will last time. 25. Felicia, you require 161. 161. What a way to take yourself Triple onto 17. the hill. Ooh. 24. Arlene, you require 87. Gordon Glenn watching on. 20. Bullseye for 6-3. 56. Lisa, you require 80. Now Ashton. Three darts in hand at 80. Another one of those least tops. Tops for 7-2. 40. Arlene, you require 31. 31. So, double eight. 23. Lisa, well, you require begging. 40. The legend, John Harvey. 40 for Lisa Ashton. That's a good marker. Oh, oh dear. 30. Arlene, you require eight. So, to continue the comeback, Eileen de Graff wants two fours. Yeah, that's and been Eileen short. De Graff gets two fours. Eileen de Graff. Ten blankets, Eileen to throw first. Game on. 6 3 scoreline in favour of Lisa Ashton. Over. Eileen de Graff. 99. Best of 15 legs. Hello. 140. 43. 60. Looks very determined this year, Eileen asked Lisa Ashton. Eighty-two. One hundred and forty. Yes. And again, the power scoring of Lisa Ashton. Edges her in front. Eighty-five. Lisa, you require one hundred and sixty-one. One six one then for Lisa. Time on our side. I went back 99. on one, one nine two. Eighty one. Lisa, you require sixty two. Not happy with that last that. Sixty two. Oh, sixty two for a seven three lead. Yeah, that's uh, game there it is. So Lisa. casual, so nonchalant. <laughs> Eleven black is Lisa. Once it stops the the graph come back in its tracks. Just 43. dropped down to just under 89 and a half. Not bad at all, though. 134. I'm mean, determined she's going to give us a 174. A few times she's missed it. Maximum. Ah. Absolutely brilliant dart from Lisa Ashton. 95. Maximum. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this lady is an absolute machine. 98 after just nine darts. <laughs> Incredible game. Utterly, utterly ridiculous. Remind me never to pick up my darts and play Lisa. No. <laughs> I'll just stay at home. Especially in public. Treble 18. Would have left double 12, but single 20. Tops when she returns. Eileen on 180. Don't bust yourself, whatever you do. What a great setup this could be. Uh, well, not bad. Eileen has 40. left 80 after 12. Surely. Oh, no. no. Wow. Well, you require 80. What a game to peg for Eileen. Tops it is then. Yeah, oh, and gets it. 
What a game to win after your opponent hits two 180s. 12 seconds are leading through first. The score line 7 4 in favour of Lisa Ashton over Eileen de Graff. One other end, 23. Great start from Eileen. 16. The average is still just under 90 for Lisa Ashton and just under 83 for her opponent, 58. Eileen de Graff. Yep, it's not bad at all. 100. Finding the trebles now, Lisa. 59. 85. Yep, not much between them. Nine darts thrown each, five points separating them. Scoreline 7 4. 16. Mylene clicking to survival. Clinging to survival in this best of 15 legs. Lisa requiring just the one 16. more leg to be crowned Australian Darts Open Champion once again. 83. Yeah, it's not a bad success rate, winning two out of three. It ain't bad, a musician once said. 17. Arlene, you require 118. But Eileen de Graff not done yet. 118. Treble 20 for double 19. No. We'll set it up as best you can. 58. Lisa, you require 126. Ashton, 1, 2, 6, 19 route. 4 19s leaves the bull. 6 19s leaves double. 6, it's the bullseye. Yep, yeah, it's a single. Bullseye. 101. Eileen, you require 60. 20 for tops. 60 to close the gap to 7 5. Double, double, why not? Oh, oh, the oh, wrong double. Whoops. Lisa, you that wasn't part of the game 25. plan. 25 for the match. For Lisa Ashton, double eight. Double four. Game. Yes. And for the second time in her illustrious career, Lisa Ashton has won the Australian Darts Open. A fantastic performance, averaging a smidge over 88 in an 8-4 victory over Eileen de Graff. An excellent performance from both ladies. Eileen de Graff can leave with her head held high. They've given us quite the show here in Moama. But it is Lisa Ashton, the number two seat, the Lancashire Rose, the four-time world champion, is now the two-time Australian Darts Open champion. And we will be back in a few minutes' time to see who will be crowned our men's champion. Belgium's Andy Duff. Andy Duff? Andy <laughs> Batten? So I'm going home. Belgium's Andy Barton takes on Northern Ireland's Neil Duff.